it was, I was late to the game, but this was one that I did take the time during this downturn. I was like, you know what? Let me look over because, you know, lots of interesting things going on with ADAS, which is the safety features in the cars now. And then with the full self-driving and autonomy. And I was like, let me look back over all of these companies because there's like six of them, you know, LIDAR companies that are coming via SPAC, you know, five or six. I don't know. But then the real the real magnitude breakthrough was when I looked over Alistair and I was like, Velodyne basically imploding from within with the things going on in their board and, and all of that. And then here's the LIDAR space in a nutshell. Most of the other companies, minus Velodyne and Alster, which today's ticker symbol is changing to OUST today. So some of the price action today is going to be because of that, you know where people can't trade. Velodyne and Alster are the only ones right now in production. Like if you if someone placed the order for an Alster LiDAR sensor, Alster could put that order in and get it going into manufacturing today. All of these others, they're prototyping, they're still building. Even Luminar, who has, you know, fabulous CEO. But Luminar also is analog, it's not digital. And the benefits of the digital platform is when it comes to economies of scale, the analog has a whole lot more moving parts. It's going to be a lot more expensive to build. It's going to be a lot more expensive to manufacturer. That's where Alistair is going to come in and they're going to, the costs will be cut left and right because all you got to do is make sure you get the specs to that are wanted and needed for whatever auto manufacturer or industrial needs or whatever the whatever the platforms that they're building these for, the specs are there. Then it's going to come down to cost. Analog is not going to be able to compete with digital for cost. When that revelation hit me, I'm going to tell you, I really loaded up on Alistair. And then I also spent the time, I, I watched it there investor day. I watched the more recent, like yesterday they had a Cohen uh, mobility they attended and I mean, he basically broke it down as well the CEO that really is, is them and Velodyne they're going to win in price and they're, they're also winning with customers like I mean just go to the website or Google Alster and look at the contracts that are getting signed week after week after week after week so you know it, it's one of those things where honestly this one is more of a longer term play for me and I'm and I, I went big on it. <laughs>